somebody there watching. Yeah, it will be uh, actually it will be a different title, but uh, I just oh. um, do it this way. Okay, live. Uh, we just see the my face will come up. <coughs> so let me see. Hello, everybody. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Hello, everybody. Sorry for the interruption we had earlier with uh, this project, but now I have a very sub sub um, unexpected, surprising uh, seal for you to see. This is a very unusual opportunity to show you a very different uh, style of carving that you haven't seen before. It's called uh, the Yuan style, signature mark style. Um, Yuan, Ya, or uh, let me write this down. Maybe someone read Chinese. It means the uh, Yuan style uh, mark or signature mark of a Yuan style, uh, which means uh, it originated in Yuan Dynasty with the foreign um, government uh, from uh, uh, the Normans, you know, the Chinggis Khan's government. They don't uh, have Chinese name, but they translate into Chinese or use uh, uh, a, a, a handwriting signature, which is uh, look like Chinese, but some readable, some not. Uh, so that's where it is, uh, originated. And we, we use that style to carve uh, handwriting. So you have to write the, your name in the uh, uh, with a marker pen, not the regular pen, because uh, we cannot carve this uh, very thin one. We have to use a marker pen with a uh, two millimeter thickness or, or something like that. So we have worked hard on, oh, I think we have that sheet downstairs. Anyway, you can see how we worked so far. Uh, um, and we have a, um, Final result here. Uh, I, I used the computer to scan uh, to put on the computer so I can make multiple copies for the transfer um, on the stone. Now I already have it. Uh, so this is from an actual person's uh, handwriting. Uh, the idea is that uh, um, this is uh, used as a signature on your. Um, Whoops, I think I'm not seeing what I'm, I'm, I'm looking at a recording right now. I don't know, it looks like it's something, it's not me. It's something else. That <laughs> yeah, that's weird. Uh, let me make sure, let me refresh it. Okay. Here's the other. Okay, let me start over. Mm -hmm. I think that we're not looking at uh, the right. I didn't want to say anything because Mm -hmm. I wasn't sure. Okay, here we go. I think this is live. It's not showing you. Yeah, it is live. Okay. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Again, uh, we just want to make sure we are on the same page. I think they're, they're seeing the new ones, not the recording. <laughs> so <laughs> here's the process. We created this uh, handwriting style or um, signature chop style. Uh, so you can do this at home, um, just to practice your the signature and the put using a marker pen uh, to write. You can put the stone, you know, as a template. You, we copy the stone, like, you know, you draw a, a square with the stone, and then you write within that stone to get this. And we liked this uh, part of uh, this part of the uh, character river, and uh, the left, the right character says dance. Uh, in the ancient script, it is more complicated. So we give up that it's more strokes. Anyway, uh, you can see the arc of bone or the the bronze style there, the bronze style. Uh, so we designed all that, and we come up with uh, this kind of uh, style that uh, is more handwriting style. 
So we already transferred this, this design onto the stone. I'm going to carve it. Um, I wish I have this signature style here. Let me transfer. Let me get it from my computer. See if I can do it. Just a second. I wish I connected. No, I'm not. Um, hmm. Well, you have to look at a different picture than the picture we are carving. I can transfer that image, maybe. Hold on, one minute. Uh, without, uh, uh, let me just focus on this so they can see exactly <coughs> what we're working on. <sighs> All right, I'm going to carve the, the margin first. This is a, a Qingtian stone, so very um, relatively easy to carve stone. Soap stone, they call it. So I want to keep that chipping fields of uh, the ancient seal. So that corner will be gone. Open that, so we say it let the the seal to brace. We give an exit of the chi. Mm -hmm. It's good to have the original designer here, the artist who designed me to watch. It give me the extra energy to the inspiration. Okay, I think she did a really good job on the handwriting we have. style carving, you cut out the backgrounds. So there are a lot of scooping or flooring work there. So we just do the stroke for now. A lot of scooping there. <coughs> and uh, this part it's dance. So dance river is the meaning. We got from a uh, an ancient uh, Asia <laughs> professor in UC Berkeley, right? Uh, a Japanese scholar. So yeah. he's the author of the Shinto priest. Oh, Shinto priest. I'm sorry. Shinto priest. Yeah, he's one of the first students to learn Aikido. Oh, yeah. That's uh, that's his uh, um, artist name there. East East Ren, right? The one mountain man. That's a 
his seal. Yeah. As an example, the style guide. Yeah, that's what we're trying to get uh, the same kind of style. Break the margin, so just do it very boldly. It would be a lot of chipping. <laughs> yeah. You're free to comment on oh, any, because uh, people want to see what you feel. I think they are seeing more, or hear more <laughs> than they could hear over the internet. So what's different to you? Well, you're carving it upside down. Oh, yes, correct. Right? Yeah, I have to rotate the stone. Instead of uh, doing it in one direction, I just, you know, rotate the stone. So I always go this way. So I don't have to change my hand uh, mm -hmm. around the stone. I have this, uh, right. So let me do this stroke first. If you like this, the smooth side, I have to cut uh, in two different directions. So they, they all stay. If I keep doing it in one direction, one side will be rough. You can see that. You can see what I mean. Oh. Yeah, because one side chips a lot mm -hmm. than the other. I think we like the chipping, so we we'll just let it chip. Design part is the most time consuming process. We spent two hours almost, right? Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> to do the research, we started from the Chinese etymology, the origin of the Chinese writing system, back to the article bone style. And then we did the, the design with the, the uh, the grid, the yeah, the pictographs. Yeah. Then we decided to go with uh, the handwriting style of the Yuan Dynasty. Wow, what's a journey? Historically, <laughs> it's a mm -hmm. yeah history. <laughs> sure. Yeah, getting a real history lesson. Right. It was wonderful. Yeah. We had a lesson on the. Uh, because when you design something, you really understand the the, Ch the Chinese writing system, and uh, the way the Chinese syst writing system has to do with uh, pictographs, the the meaning of the words. And this first character, dance, is also uh, the same origin of uh, the word nam bing or nothing or negative words. You know. <laughs> And I, I, t I, I showed the artist uh, why, because <laughs> this is my uh, research subject. <laughs> Actually, I did an essay on it uh, many years ago when I was in Seattle, uh, University of Washington, on this uh, evolution of this character. So many people asked me earlier how many years I have been practicing this art. 
I will say the whole life <laughs> because uh, uh, you know when you have to sp to understand the Chinese writing as a kid. Uh, the in the university I studied the ancient script, the the Ark of Mount Stadel, so as uh, Ark of Mount uh, script, and the bronze script as archaeology. Uh, Historical archaeology. I learned uh, archaeology is, it belongs to history department, not uh, the uh, anthropology department in China. So when I come to this country to pursue my doctoral degree, I uh, cannot study archaeology because it's in anthropology. So I, I studied ancient Chinese history instead. And I taught uh, ancient uh, Chinese culture and the philosophy at the university level. Oh, oh. let's see if there's something I have to pay attention here. I have to look at it this way. Because I didn't make a flipped image. It's a little bit hard to me to. Okay, I think I need uh, the extra space there, right? Did it? Uh, oh, there's just enough space on this side. Okay, I, oh, I did right. That's not probably. Oh, we got the extra space there. That's okay. <coughs> okay, almost done. Just the fine tuning a little bit. School, scooping. Uh, a lot of floor work. This is all cosmetic. Actually, it's not going to affect any anything oh. on, on the final result. But cosmetically, it looks nicer to make it a little a little nicer. Just scoop. It's okay to have some uh, some extra stroke or dots, just as long as aesthetically okay. Clean up. Wow. <laughs> There's a long way to go still. I, <laughs> I just. Uh, uh, let's see. That was fast. Took a while to get there. That's why you know, people ask me if you can show me your design before I order. I say no. It takes. <laughs> <laughs> this is how much work we have done. That's a lot of work. Yeah, oh, nice. I'm gonna test it out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. We we'll just. Is that what I have to do when I want to use? Yeah. It too, yeah. You you. Um, Tap it gently. This one gets dry, so I, um, oh. I press too hard. Okay. Maybe uh, you can tap gently, not uh, too 
pull any fab fiber out, just uh, uh -huh. gently tap. Yeah. Uh -huh. And then uh, we just use this paper to put on the side of the design. Okay. Has to press really hard. Huh? Yeah, you, you have to use a magazine. Oh, it's sideways. Don't worry, <laughs> I will put uh, my signature on, oh, the, on, oh, on okay. to show you the orientation. Okay, we'll have to uh, clean up something, I think, always. Mm -hmm. But uh, this is very, very close, I think, to the effect we want. Yes. Okay. <coughs> Let me see. I think so, some more broken uh, at least another okay. broken line or something. Okay. Yeah, I can do that. Um, yeah, we can open that, that uh, river um, side. Okay. Just like that, and then this could be this another one here. And just we can do that. Let me see. And uh, I think that's narrow enough. Okay, some uh, chipping. Oh, oh, chipping. Yeah, this is a way to prevent it from uh, oh. duplicating. I oh, cannot, I, I oh. cannot. Yeah. So artists were concerned about that. Yeah. They're working, yeah. Well, oh, lots of chips. <laughs> I should blow it away before I do this. <laughs> But it has a lot of chips buried there. Oh, it does. Oh, okay. Okay. Another one. You make it look easy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And uh, let me get the paper towel. Oh, oh. awesome. 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 I need paper towel. Paper towel. In, in the yeah, you can take look a closer an look closer an look. Uh, look an ancient ancient script. Oh, yeah. awesome! That's so great. Yeah, um, I, I want to make this part a little thinner okay. to look more natural. This is what I'm doing right now. Right. And uh, um, mm -hmm. other than that, I think it's pretty much uh, what we expected. Huh? Um, yeah, something there. Something, I think the bottom should be a little thicker than the top. Maybe we should open the top. I don't know. Uh -huh. if, uh, um, we can make the, the top more open. Okay, let me see. Wow, you got it in the little space. <laughs> Yeah, I just uh, if the, I, I chipped a little bit. It will be a little bit open, mm -hmm. so we uh, we can be very bold or very conservative. This, you know, you, you can you can control everything, yeah. but that will be more um, unnatural sometimes. You just let it go. Some it's a random lock locking. You know, it's a it's uh, oh, just like a Chipping. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. So, how old is this paste? Uh, more than <laughs> 10 years. <laughs> more than 10 years. <laughs> it really lasts a long time. Yeah.
I, I blow a little air to mm -hmm. reduce the grain. Uh, oh, oh. The, it's hot um, and uh, moisturized, you know, just to make it. Um, so it's not so wet. Yeah. I think the this dot is still too thick, do you think? Which one are you pointing this, to? This 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 edge. It's right here. This 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 uh, edge dot. Oh. We can make it that little less I think there's sand in it. It's pretty hard. So that's Okay, I, I chipped a little bit on top, that's enough, mm -hmm. I think. We can make it thinner if you want. No, I think it's good. It's all good? I it's good. Good. Yeah, I think otherwise yeah. it's less wet. No. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, we can... I think I, I smoothed out the, this side already a little bit, so it will yeah. not be so rough. Okay. This, this, this side, outside of the river side, this side. This left side. Yeah. This one, all the other sides should be fine. So I'm going to make a custom, I mean, a final copy on my, on my collection book. So these are the recent works I've done. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, some, like, this is, uh, I like the two yeah. characters, the old, mm -hmm. old soul for a friend. Soul. Yeah, for oh. my for, uh, artist name. So this is uh, mm -hmm. uh, Dharma names for people who, uh, follows Buddhist Buddhism. Yeah. Dharma, Dharma, Dharma name. Dharma name. Dharma name. Oh, yeah. Okay. Mm. Okay. Oh, a lot of paintings. People have like two and three. Yeah, I explained earlier in this video that um, um, you can have a uh, a name seal a a. Uh, Pen name seal and uh, a mood seal. So that's what I'm going to do next. Oh. Actually, I have all the designs here with the from a uh, requested from a, an, a Korean artist. So this, I suppose, this is a more Japanese uh, kanji seal you got from the your, your yeah your, your, uh, My, mentor yeah your teacher your teacher. Korean and Japanese, Chinese are the same in, in, in seal tradition. Okay. It's all kanji, you know, it's all yeah. Chinese characters, have some meanings, not just the alphabet or the <laughs> kanas. So you, you press hard and hold the paper before you lift it with your fingers. Mm -hmm. okay. So the paper will not stick uh, with the, the truck. Okay, very nice. Huh? Very nice. Yeah, I like it. Very nice. Yeah, I like it. I like it too. You see, you you don't see this often in my seals. I, no. <laughs> I these are our seal script. This is uh, so I may have done like some in, in the in the past. Yeah. This is a signature style. This pictograph is like uh, this. This oh, pictograph. Okay. This ancient script. But this is different. This is handwriting, cursive style. Yeah. Cursive style. I like it. This. Uh, Does it come out a lighter red just because? Oh yeah, because my my is, paste is getting is dry. Getting dry. Uh, I can do better on oh, on on, on a different paper. This paper is uh, too yeah. absorb, absorbent. Oh. Yeah, this paper would be better. The card paper I use. Mm. Yeah. yeah, I think I got it's too dry. I need to. Change it. Put some water on it? No, this is oil based. Oh, it's oil yeah. based. Yeah, actually, oh. all the water I blow may may reduce the intensity, so I, I don't blow it anymore. Oh, yeah. The, the, because <laughs> the, the layer of the water in the, on the surface may affect the in color intensity. Uh -huh. So that's a drawback. If you, if you blow too much moisture from your mouth, it might make it light. Okay, that's oh, what okay. uh, could happen. So let me. I I I'm just in <laughs> habit, habit. In habit to do this. Just a little bit. For good luck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's an old habit. 
people think I can't that. believe how hard you have to press. Yeah, it's wow. uh, because the stone is is hard. Uh, there the has to be soft, uh, not a rubber stem. You don't have yeah. to uh, put a soft padding on it. There's mm -hmm. it's soft under it. Mm -hmm. I can wave a little bit, like yeah. a shake a little Sorry. bit, but not to move. Then hold it. Yeah, see, this is a little sharper than. Oh, oh, that is beautiful. Wow. Yeah, you, can, you can have that. Can I, I have that? Yeah, yeah. Oh, That's that for is you. nice. Me, um, I, I'll make another you cream. You have to copy. sign it, though. <laughs> oh, yeah, I will do that before you leave. Uh, okay, I will make another copy for myself for oh. my book. I have an e-book oh, yeah. already. I don't have oh, time okay. to publish another one, but uh, yeah. I did uh, maybe 300 more. I did uh, the first 300 uh, also uh, is uh, in the book. If ebook you can download it and now i have second book coming so but, how many uh, have you done i think more than 800 maybe <laughs> i don't I didn't, I didn't count i have like a 10 volumes of this 10 volumes wow If you press less, the line would be thinner. Okay. Yeah. So just uh, if you press harder, the line becomes less. So every imprint could be different. Yeah, this is another one. Beautiful. Okay, I'll carve oh, the nice. signature on the uh, left side. So your uh, okay. when you when you when you hold it, you will know the the mark on the left side. This is a row. I'll do the year. Oh no, it's, I'm not holding yeah. it upside down. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. This is the year of the, the pick, my birth year. Oh. I'm getting to 60. <laughs> it's a big, big year. So I always carve this year on my seal or oh. painting. Oh, okay. The, the year of the pick. The year of the pig. I see you're painting some pigs too. Yeah. That's really, really good. Thank you. Mm. I just carved my Chinese name, Xiao Hui. What is it? Xiao, Xiao Hui. Xiao Hui? Yeah. Hui means uh, morning. Oh, uh, sunshine. Hui. Sunshine. Yeah, morning sunshine. Uh, morning Xiao. My name doesn't have any meaning. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're, you're, you're American. <laughs> you're, this is your oh, name, well, right? This is, this is a, yeah, name. dance. You're a dancer. Uh, no, you're, I mean my, my you're, parents, you're from, you know. Uh, I mean. Yeah, you're a English name. But yeah, you can have an artist name has nothing to do with your your English mm -hmm. name. So this is a Dance River. Yes. Right? Yeah. So River Dance or, or, or yeah, Dancing River Dance. River. Dancing River. Dancing River. I think your signature, your 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 calligraphy is very um, flowed like a dance. Well, you helped me with that. Yeah. <laughs> it took a while to get there. But not everybody can do it. <laughs> it took a while to get there. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, that this is too cool. Yeah, this is my my name. Uh, let me make take some pictures before you go. So. Yes. I have a record of this. I always show yeah. people on the Facebook or so. Mm -hmm. Let me see, it's just... Uh, it's really easy to hold it, my friend. Thank you. Just a single shot. Well, you get to keep that one. Mm -hmm. Oh, which one is better? I keep. You keep. Uh, you have. Yeah, you have that one. Okay. Yeah. Okay, that's yours. Uh, your case is on this uh, downstairs. Right. Anyway, so I would make a um, uh, stop now. I will come back for the rest of the video project. Thank everybody for watching on YouTube.
Okay, well, I got a question before I go. Uh, what's the difference between Japanese and Chinese sales? Um, let me just say no difference. <laughs> <laughs> no difference. Okay, I, yeah, we already talked about that. It's a Japanese seal, but it's uh, also a Chinese seal. It's kanji, mm -hmm. uh, Chinese characters. And uh, the design you saw on this video um, on the left, lower left, is a Korean name, um, Brocade History. Um, Rocket History is the, the name of the artist, and uh, the the authentic uh, Korean seal. So Korean uh, seal and Japanese seal are the same. Okay. Thank you. Bye bye now. See you later. <laughs>